Hi, I'm Grace Chamolu from Product Management Festival. Thank you very much for joining us today for this information session on the Product Management Executive Program. At any time during today's session, please feel free to submit your questions to the side of the window pane, uh, and I'll be sure to get to them. What I will be going over today, we'll have a few slides to cover, and then we'll go into the Q&A session. What is the Product Management Executive Program? It's an accelerated executive level leadership development and advanced product management program, and it's brought to you by Product Management Festival and INSEAD. What I'm going to cover today is the program, who is it for, how you would benefit, the faculty affiliated with it, as well as the program schedule, program feedback, and how to apply. How you would benefit the faculty affiliated with it, as well as the program schedule, the product management feedback. The product management executive program is the, for sorry for those of you who don't know the, the product management festival is an organization whose mission is to amplify the impact of product management globally, not only on the products themselves but also on their organizations, and to help product managers be more successful. We have been hearing from people we meet through our annual conferences and local initiatives that there was a desire and need for more resources and training. And not just for the standard product management and leadership topics, but also for areas more relevant at the executive level. As product managers' careers, pro, uh, careers progress, their roles shift to start focusing on more strategic areas, such as shaping and influencing the organization. Therefore, the standard product management education becomes insufficient at this point. And so we partnered with INSEAD, a leader in executive education and the number one ranked international business school two years in a row by the Financial Times. I'm just trying to get our slides to progress. Apologize for that. So this program will help you gain the tools, knowledge, and know-how to lead effectively and to amplify your impact on the organization. The upcoming programs, um, the first one will be April 1st through 5th in Fontainebleau, France. Um, this is at the INSEAD campus. And then the second program will be the 2nd to 6th of September in Fontainebleau, France as well. If you're interested in a program on the NCI campus at Singapore, please inquire um, and you can send an email to exec at productmanagementfestival.com. I'll just make a note here that each program is independent of the other and you do not need to travel to both of the programs or among campuses to be able to complete the program. This program is for current and rising product management executives. It will be relevant to those who are transitioning into the executive level and wish to accelerate their learning or be more aware of what areas will need to be developed, such as a different level of communication or execution as they make their next career move. It's also for current product management executives who wish to refine their executive level skills. Sometimes, we don't have the benefit of a mentor, and on-the-job training can sometimes only go so far, especially if you are entering uncharted territory with the company. This program can help expose you to additional tools, scenarios, experiences, and processes that could help you. We will be covering advanced product management topics, so it will be taught at the level of someone who has already had a fair number of years experience in product management, or at least exposure. How could this program benefit you? I'll go through five reasons, though there are many more. 
The first is in acknowledging and developing your leadership style so you can lead yourself and your organization through growth and change. At the executive level, you have so much more power. But as the saying goes, with great power comes great responsibility. So it's critical you understand your leadership style and how you impact others. And you can develop your capacity to exercise your leadership effectively and responsibly within your organization because then you can better understand how to affect change. As product managers progress in their careers, their responsi responsibilities start to shift. We rely on your ability to lead through the organization, ability to influence and navigate through networks, and to get the job done. And at the executive level, this ability to lead and influence continues and with greater impact. If you thought being a product manager was tough, having all that responsibility with no authority, just think of how it will be having to influence stakeholders at the executive level and who are all your peers. I found this quote from a Forbes article and thought it was insightful. The dynamics will change. You are a leader to a group of leaders. The second benefit is effectively building developing and retaining your teams. And that requires an understanding of your impact on group dynamics. I think it goes without saying that it's pretty hard to grow and develop a product team if you don't have a good hold on retention. Turnover costs can range from 93 to 200% of an exiting employee's salary. And I'll also note that this is from an article that's titled, Voluntary Turnover. They usually leave their bosses and not their jobs. If you need to scale your team, retention is key. But this is not just about being a good manager. This is also about understanding your impact on group dynamics, on how to effectively use your networks, on how to scale a team in a sustainable way, and how to develop and manage product management culture. Most of us need to work hard to learn how to be good and effective managers and leaders. And as that responsibility grows, I challenge you to strive to be the executive that great team members want to work with, or be the executive that you would want to work with. Complementing the leadership sessions, we will have product management specific sessions that are taught by guest speakers who are currently heading up their product management organizations at their companies. They will give you insight into what they've learned, their successes and mistakes, and provide you with actionable, practical information that you can apply or look into applying once you get back home. Some of us don't have the benefit of mentors, especially at the executive level where there are fewer product management executives, or there are mentors available at the executive level, but they don't have insight into what product management specific challenges you might face. This program can help with that. And while many of us learn from on-the-job training, which I'm a big fan of, but sometimes we don't have the luxury of time to learn from our mistakes. Sometimes we also don't have the financial leeway to make too many large-scale mistakes. So learn from those who have come before you. And as I like to think of it, don't repeat mistakes that you can already sidestep. If you're going to make mistakes, go make new ones that you can learn from. Another benefit of the program is the focus on critical softer skills that are often overlooked. Many feel that they worked on areas like communications, negotiations, networking, and think that they're all set. But these are skills that always could use refining. And now you're in an executive role where you're communicating with groups with whom you may have not had to before, a board, investors, strategic partners, the press, your words have farther reach and bigger implications and impact. Your communication can potentially affect stock price, land or lose a key client or partner, trigger a lawsuit, a list can go on. Uh, you'll just need to be ever mindful of your communication style and other soft skills. 
This program will help you refine and strengthen those skills and increase your self-awareness so you can maximize those soft skills to your advantage. Finally, I think we've probably all have already heard about how important it is to network. Most organizations don't have teams of product managers around. And so oftentimes we hear how product managers feel they're alone in their situations. But after meeting other product managers, such as at an event like PMF or a local meetup group or reading articles and books, they realize that many of the problems that they're actually experiencing are also experienced by many others. This program will be bringing senior level product managers together. You will not only learn from the faculty, but also from each other. You'll become part of a community from which you will reap the benefits for years to come. This program is not possible without our faculty. Our program director is Noah Askin, who is an assistant professor of organizational behavior at INSEAD, who teaches the executive education classes as well as the organizational design and leadership courses in the core MBA program. He's also received the Dean's Commendation, Commendation of Excellence in Teaching Award as well. We also have guest speakers who are product management executives at their respective organizations. And this is the snapshot of the faculty that's affiliated with our program. Um, in each program, we have a few of them who are able to come and join us to share their lessons learned with you. In the interest of time, I won't go over each of the names right now, but you can find the faculty information on the website. And here's a view to a sample program. The program is split within the week with three days of executive leadership sessions led by NOAA and two days of product management specific sessions led by the guest faculty. This is a sample agenda, but for example, with Professor Askim, there will be sessions on understanding and how to build and use your network and using informal power um, and such as power and status to help with your ability to influence. There will be a, an assortment of group cases and uh, workshops and exercises, lecture. So it will be a combination of um, teaching delivery. And then for the product management specific sessions, there will be things on scaling and product culture, product portfolio management, um, measuring the impact at scale. One question that we get a lot of is the feedback, what, what feedback we've been receiving uh, from the program. So I'd like to share some brief highlights with you. This is our class from the program that was from uh, France in last year. Of the 25 participants in that group, we had nine C-levels, four were CPOs, and the others were CTOs and COOs who had product reporting to them. We also had seven vice presidents and heads of products, and five director and senior PM levels. They came from throughout Europe, US and Russia, and hailed from companies such as Booking.com, WeTransfer, Zipcar, Shipstead, and many others. The program received an NPS score of 87.5. And when we asked what was the single most important reason behind recommending the program, a few examples of the reasons cited. The content is precisely for product leaders, no wasting of time for completely unrelated topics. There's, there's so much knowledge in just the five days. The quality of the sessions and the group discussions with the other participants were, were really good. Uh, and it's a very stimulating program group experience. So how can you become a part of this unique program? To apply for the program, you can visit our website of productmanagementfestival.com, or you can email us at exec at productmanagementfestival.com for the application. Applications are due to INSEAD by the deadline for the respective program, uh, and for the deadlines also listed on the website, but you will then subsequently receive an admissions notification decision from INSEAD, uh, and, but at any time, of course, feel free to email us as well uh, if you would like any assistance or more information. So just a quick recap, the upcoming program we have is uh, April 1st through 5th. 
on the Fontainebleau campus. And then our second one of the year will be also in France for the 2nd to 6th of September for the fall program. Uh, it's a five-day program, 9,200 euro. And for more information, once again, you could visit the productmanagementfestival.com website. So as we wrap up, I wanted to share a graphic that I saw courtesy of Professor Askin from the presentation he had done recently on the skills needed for a product manager. And he encapsulates very well what is needed to be a successful senior level product manager. It's the brain of an engineer, the heart of a designer, the tongue of a diplomat, and the herding skills of an Australian shepherd. We understand the types of challenges you face as a product manager, and this program can help you become a stronger product management executive and help you amplify your impact on the organization. So I'd like to thank you very much for joining us for this information session. Once again, if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us at exec at productmanagementfestival.com. At this point, I'll stop sharing my screen and so we can take a quick look at a couple questions. So one of the questions that we received um, and that we often get as well is, what does the tuition cover? So the tuition covers the program sessions, the course materials, as well as the catering for the week. Uh, one thing it does not cover uh, is accommodations. So one of the things that does occur though is that INSEAD will provide a hotel reservation um, for the official hotel for this program. And it's usually very close uh, to the facilities. So they'll make a reservation on your behalf um, once you receive an admissions notification decision. Uh, but then in terms of determining whether that is the hotel you would like to stay at, as well as the financial responsibility for that hotel, that would be on the applicant. Um, also a question that we have is more about the evening activities. Um, so will there be organized activities during the event? So outside of the program, the daytime programs, uh, there are a few structured uh, events in the evening, opening dinner, closing dinner, for example. And there's just a, a, a few things that do happen on some of the days, but not all. Uh, it is, of course, not mandatory for you to attend them. However, it would be um, highly encouraged uh, if you could, because it's one of those chances that you can interact with the faculty, um, the guest lecturers and, and Professor Askin outside of the classroom setting, as well as also be able to provide uh, a chance for you to network and, and talk to your fellow attendees of the program outside of the classroom setting. So it's just a little bit more social setting as well. Um, and then will every program have the same faculty? So not necessarily. The As I mentioned a little bit earlier, what we have is that we have a faculty, a group of faculty members that do help advise uh, for us as well as some of them do teach. Um, but for each of the programs, we generally have about four guest faculty that come in for each program. Uh, and so in that manner, it's a subset of the group um, that you saw in the pictures. But what happens is that there is a, a core of product management topics that do, they do cover, as well as some things that are more specific to that particular uh, guest executive's uh, experience. And so we just, so every, every program does have a little bit different mix of guest faculty, um, but it's always at the, at the same quality level uh, that you would expect from a program from NCID and Product Management Festival. So that is the time we have for, them, for now. Uh, feel free to ask any questions at exec at productmanagementfestival.com. Thank you so much for joining us. Have a great day.